News continues. Doctors are concerned about what they're calling a twindemic. That is a surge of cases of both the flu and the coronavirus. Yeah, that is why many experts are now pushing for people to get their flu shots if they haven't already. As West Chu's Michelle Meredith reports, doctors expect the season will be more severe than last. The warnings seem never ending, and the warning for this flu season, it could be a bad one. Last year, because of COVID, many social distanced were masked. It helped stop the spread of coronavirus, but it also helped stop the spread of the flu. This year is different. With the vaccine comes more freedom, fewer masks. In my personal practice, I've actually seen just a couple of cases so far, meaning that influenza is already on our doorstep. It's just not making that huge jump as of yet. So before the huge jump hits, medical experts recommend get a flu shot, especially children who right now are not able to get the COVID-19 vaccine. And coming right around the corner, Halloween. Where kids can all get together and they're all in costume, but they're all going to be congregating together, sharing germs. Getting that vaccine can make a huge difference in keeping your kiddos safe and eventually keeping the adults safe as well. Can you get your flu and COVID shots at the same time? It's allowed, but some doctors recommend waiting about two weeks. The time between the two can definitely give your, your body the chance to build up antibodies to one, and then it gives your, chance, your body the chance to build up the antibodies to the other one as well. Putting both in at the same time is something that's going to be not as tested before. In a time where every season feels like a test and reminder of how different our lives have become with coronavirus. In Orange County, Michelle Meredith, West 2 News.